This is Star Talk. Computers are so reliable and they're so much part of our everyday life now, we take them for granted. But somebody is in a se- literally or in a sense shoveling the coal. Okay. What happens if you unplug the supercomputer? intelligence thing it will uh find a new source of energy no 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 no, no. because the, the, it has its own nuclear reactor the failure of that logic is the assumption that it would let you unplug it right <laughs> yeah okay but how did it create that thing to keep it from i'm just saying i don't i don't i'm you know i'm with so you here it seems like a solvable problem so i'm looking here we have three three levels of intelligence artificial narrow intelligence so that's okay. computer doing one thing better than anything it's not getting anybody's way. A calculator. Calculator. Let and it do it. it. Play, one wins at Jeopardy. And, uh, and no, no, that'd be artificial general intelligence, which oh. would be general intelligence, but it's not. Uh, it, it, it's not hell bent on taking over the world. It's, it's that, that IBM computer, right? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It goes across. Yeah, yeah. yeah the, which one was that? Well, Watson. 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 It's Watson. Okay. Watson. So it's the super intelligence that scares him. And I, again, I, I kind of agree with you, Bill. You could at some point you just unplug the dude. Yeah. And, and well, I just think about uh, the Colossus project, Forbin, the Colossus project, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, and so uh, this is where these the two superpowers on Earth have uh, nuclear arsenals. They are controlled by computers, so they connect the two computers. Trouble ensues. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> and so. You try to unplug it, but they have their own nuclear reactors that run them. This is the movie War Games, like all over again. Yeah, right? yeah, the yeah. Co- well, it was before War Games. It was yeah, a yeah, novel, yeah. and so, and then a movie. But the deal is that running a nuclear power plant is not straightforward. It takes some, somebody shoveling the coal, a rate, moving <laughs> the stuff around in the uh, waste. In the pile. But there's also much much ado about the singularity. Uh, Ray Kurzweil. Oh, okay. you know, I got to get him on Star Talk because I don't. Yeah. I, I'm just not with him on this. Well, but I don't the, want to badmouth him unless he's sitting in front this of me. This is everybody. When I so do he can badmouth me back. Okay. Does this happen to you, Neil? When I do a college talk, somebody asks me about the singularity. I know. And, and people when all freak out. a computer is as smart as a human. Right. This, and this would it's be. it's always plugged in and has no arms or legs right. and does something. Right. Right. Somehow. What is it going to do? Is it going to chase you down the street? Like, what's it going to do? Well, no. It's going to actually get the machines to do its bidding for it. Yes. It'll like t- in Terminator. Your like in Right, it will that control would, your thermostat I'm, and your self-driving car. I'm cool with that. But this notion that somehow the world is fundamentally different before and after uh, this singularity. But from a historical standpoint, I could buy it. Like, no, no, we'll be different, but we're not going to be. It's, it's not we're going to be running out of the screaming out of the out of the apartment. No, when machines took over our physical labor, did we say, "Oh my gosh, this is the crazy day"? No, no, it happened slowly, and we're fine. Right and now, we got people repairing machines. Mm-hmm. I don't have, you know, so and uh, there's still artisans carving the thing. We got to get them on the show. I'm going to get him on the show, and then we'll give him a piece of our mind. (laughs) (laughs) But we can't leave people freaked out over the fate of the machines that we create and their capacity to turn us into domesticated pets. This is Star Talk.